So I already know everyone watching this has heard of Rainbow Friends. If you haven't, what rock have you been living under? But anyway, Rainbow Friends is a huge game on Roblox where you have to run away from these colorful cartoony monsters. So I figured I would try to recreate a couple of the popular ones in TPRR's OC Creator. So the first one I'm going to make is the title character, the main character, I guess, if you will, Blue. This should be pretty simple to make. It's literally all blue that has a crown on its head. So in theory here, in theory, little asterisk there, uh, it should not be difficult. So I guess the first thing we have to do is find a face that would match it. Uh, I was thinking the human head. Hey, there we go. We got the humanoid head. Uh, I think this will do. I think this is solid enough that this would work. So let's go ahead and equip that. And for color one, of course, we are going to do a nice blue. Yeah, bright blue looks good. And then color two, we're going to do the same thing. And then once we have those, we do have to do the eyes. So one eye is very large and has a huge uh, inner part of the eye. Listen, I don't know what eyes are called, okay? Don't yell at me. Uh, but this eye is going to be like some kind of button eye. I don't know if there is one, so let me let me take a look. All right, so actually I did have to switch over to the withered humanoid head just so we could get that uh, the little button eye to show up. And now we could go ahead and focus on the other eye, which is the right eye. So this one, we definitely want something pretty large. Actually, I think that works pretty well. Just the basic eye there. And then for materials, I am going to make it super, super smooth. Uh, so let's use, a, let's use a plastic for material. There we go. So the head is done. So now I do want to focus on the hat, which we just need a crown. So that should be very easy. I, I'm almost positive there's a crown in here. It is very unfortunate, but there is no crown in the game, uh, which I'm surprised by. I could have sworn there was a crown item, but there isn't. So we might just have to go ahead and skip that for Mr. Blue here, uh, which is, you know, a little unfortunate. But anyway, Blue is very tall and buff, so we should make the torso something to resemble that. Ooh, should we give him the buff torso? I think we should. I think that would fit very well. Uh, again, we are going to make it the same material. We're going to make it a plastic. And then we are going to make it blue. So let's go ahead and equip those. Material, plastic again, of course. Uh, then color one will be the bright blue. And we are just going to keep doing that for everything. Uh, now let's find the arms as well. Uh, he doesn't have any hands, but I don't know if there are any that would actually fit with this. Yeah, so it looks like we're going to have to go with the buff arms again, just like the body. And of course, make it all plastic. And then make it all bright blue. And then of course, we are going to go over to the other arm and do the same exact thing. Going to make it a buff arm. We could give it the infinity gauntlet, uh, but I don't think that uh, it looks a little strange. It looks a little weird. And then for the legs, I think we should just do the same thing. Uh, we should just go ahead and give it the buff legs, which I don't know if they're a thing, actually. I don't know if buff legs are in the game or not. Uh, so we have to come up with something else. Ooh, actually, the Krampus legs do kind of fit pretty well with the stubby little legs that Blue has. So what if, what if we hypothetically just went ahead and used Krampus's legs here? I mean, it's not exactly the same, but I'm going to go ahead and give it the police cap uh, because there's no other hat to give it. And there you go. It's blue. It's blue? Yeah, I think that. I mean, that is the closest that I think we're going to get. Luckily for the next animatronic, Orange, or I guess the next monster, animatronic, whatever you want to call it. This one should be a lot easier, uh, at least from the parts that I've seen while looking for the other one. So for the head, we need some kind of reptile, really scary, sharp tooth head. Uh, I, I do think we're going to go towards something with Foxy, just because I don't know what else is available. Uh, I think Foxy would be a good one. 
Let's see if there's any, like, lizard. Let's see if there's any lizard parts here. Actually, wait just a second. There is the shark head. What about the dinosaur head? Ooh, wait a second. I think... Oh, dinosaur or a shark? I... I want to say shark fits better than dinosaur. I can't find them now. All right, let's go ahead and just equip this. There we go. Now I can see it. Oh. Oh, wait. This is... This is tough. I'm going to have to go with shark head. Because it is smaller and thinner. Which uh, the orange character is also, you know? Uh, so let's go ahead and equip the shark head. And again, I am going to make it all smooth and everything. But... We need to go on the eyes. Luckily, I did see some reptile eyes earlier. So that is what we're going to go with. As soon as I find them again. There it is. Reptile eye. Which eyeball is it in? Uh, reptile. Reptile. Hey, there we go. We got both of the reptile eyes in. Uh, let's go with the smooth plastic for materials. And then for color, of course, we are going to go with an orange. Uh, not like that. There we go. That's a better orange. And then, same thing here. Uh, it does change the teeth, which is a little unfortunate. Uh, but the rest of it is uh, pretty orange. So, I think this is one of those things that we will take. Uh, the body is super, super thin. So, I wonder if there's anything that's like a little stick. Some kind of like stick body. Actually. Actually. But can I change? I don't think I could change the color of this, though. That is so unfortunate. That is so unfortunate. You can't change the color of the endo. That would be actually perfect. All right. We got to find a different one. Uh, it's looking like the toy foxy torso is... Or just the fox torso is what it's going to have to be. Because it's the thinnest one. And it just, it just makes the most sense. So again, smooth plastic, bright orange, and then the same thing for material two, smooth plastic and bright orange. There we go, the body is secure. Uh, I am actually gonna go ahead and move the head down a little. Actually, am I? I might not, I might leave it just like that. And then same with the arms, those are thin as well. Why can't I, there we go, I couldn't select it. Oh, actually, I'm gonna go with the branch arms, I think. I think having the branch arms would be uh, really fitting here. Gonna make it a smooth plastic. The color will be bright orange. And I don't think color two matters. Uh, same with material two, but I'm gonna change them anyway, just to be safe. Uh, then we also have to adjust this now, because this is all kinds of messed up here. And then of course, I'm gonna do the same thing on this side as well. Gonna go over and grab the branch arm and I gotta buy it. And then we're gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna adjust it again to put it into the right spot. Hey, I mean, so far so good. I think it's coming along pretty well, sort of, kind of. And now let's go ahead and adjust the legs as well. Uh, we do need very thin legs here. Uh, bird? Nope. Uh, toy? A fox? Maybe? Maybe chicken. I'm thinking chicken. I think chicken is definitely the way to go. We'll do smooth plastic, just like the rest of the body. And we'll do bright orange, of course, because this character is orange. That's literally its name. And just like that, both orange and blue are done. So I do want to head over to one of the maps and check them out. And uh, let's, let's, see, let's see what kind of monsters we've created here. Hey, first things first, we have blue. Who, uh, I mean, does it look too bad i don't think i mean it's got the hat on it's all blue it's muscular it's a little bit more muscular than the blue from rainbow friends but i mean if it was turned into an animatronic i think i think this is a pretty good uh <laughs> judge of its character uh, i could be wrong but i think this turned out pretty well uh <laughs> all right let's move on to character number two let's see how orange came out I mean, this is pretty great. You can tell just by looking at it who it's supposed to be. Uh, from from Rainbow Friends, it's orange, clearly, because he's all orange. And he's the arms are a little messed up. Uh, I don't know how. I could have sworn that was all the way over. 
But anyway, that is going to be it for this video. If you've seen my other uh, custom characters in TPRR, you know uh, they always do kind of come out cursed. I don't know. I don't know what happened. I just they always come out cursed for some reason. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, comment, and let me know which characters I should make next. And of course, subscribe, all that other good stuff. And I will see you in the next video whenever that is. Until then, bye.